When I arrived at the club, it wasn't... I think a lot of people inside and outside of football asked me, why are you taking that job? And especially why are you taking it at that moment in time? Because I think you saw, you know, 18 months ago, we saw a club that, you know, was cha- was struggling um, in terms of a very lean squad. You know, a lot of our historically top players had left to other competitors here in Kenya or had went abroad. You know, um, we were having to promote a lot from the youth academy. We had a transfer ban and a significantly reduced budget. You know, you go back, you go back five, six years, and Kogalo always was the team that had the biggest budget in the league and one of the biggest in the region. Um, whereas now we're probably the third or fourth budget in Kenya. So for us, we've got to be a lot more creative. So people said to me, "Why have you went and taken that job?" And there was two reasons. One, Gormaya will always be Gormaya. You know, they are a huge club, a huge name, not just in Kenya, but on the African continent. But also for me, I looked at the situation, a club that, you know, needed a certain character to sort of grab hold of them and and give them that hand back to the top table. And, And I thought, you know, I know myself, I know what skills I bring. I think also more importantly, I know what skills I lack in terms of who I need to have around me, in terms of coaching staff, in terms of support. But I just felt the ingredients would be right to make a really special recipe here in Nairobi and for us to bring Kogalo back to the top table. And look, after 50 games, we've collected two of the three trophies that are available. We find ourselves sitting in first position again in the Kenyan Premier League. And we're on, if you include last season, we're on a run of 15 games without defeat. So we're really in a good moment, Um, but there's always more. There's always more required, there's always more asked for. But I think overall we can can give ourselves a positive review over the last 16 months, but at the same time understand that we need to do at least the same amount of improvement again over the next season and a half if we're to reach those lofty goals of being not just competitive here in Kenya, but being competitive on the continent as well.